Welcome back, you beautiful people. The modern trail bike is the perfect platform and has proven itself that you can pretty much throw anything at it. You can go descending big mountains, you can go bike packing, epic adventures, and you can go racing on this thing. Yeah, cool, but the enduro bikes, I think, have proven that you can have all that and more. These are the jack of all trades and the master of what? Of the most important one. What's that? Bombing down hills fast. Ma it's not all about going fast down hills, Neil. It's not, everyone's not like you. What? Anyway, this is trail versus enduro bike. Bring it on, Neil. <laughs> I sit in between the 120 and the 160 mil range, which covers between XE and Enduro bikes. That's quite a lot of bikes to cover. What more do you want? Got 150 mil right here, 130 on the rear. I don't need anything else. It's quite a lot of bike. Enduro bikes are about 160 mil travel up to about 180 and then you're getting into downhill bike territory. They're the only bikes with more travel. They got up to about 200. But, whereas the downhill bike is really good for one thing, the Dura bike's just so versatile. You can rail them down the hill and still pedal them back to the top. Call me Bucky Nuke. Lucky that I'm innocent. Uh, if I didn't have no morals, I'd be menacing. Uh, how about Nick rapping conscious, but he ignorant. Uh, how he found a hub, but still gon' go legitimate. Uh, my enduro bike is an Orbea Rallon. This is a big 29er machine, although you can run this in mixed wheel size. The 27.5 rear comes with a spare linkage. It's got 160 mil of rear travel with a big Fox 38 mil fork on the front, 170 mil travel. This is the same bike that the Orbea EWS team ride at the races. I ain't looking at the clock, still falling like Brock. Oh, yeah, I'm headed to the bus, then I'm balling like, yeah. So it's pretty much a race bred bike that you can use for everything and you're going to want to use for everything. This is my new proof reactor RS290. 290 standing for with the wheel size of my bike, 29 inch wheels, front and rear. And on the front, I'm boasting 150 mil of travel thanks to that RockShox Lyric Ultimate. And on the rear is a 130 mil travel, but the special thing about my bike, because it is more of an aggressive trail bike, you've got a flip chip right here. So you've got rail or trail. I've done enough railing, so I've got it in trail mode because I'm out here in the Forest of Dean, and I'm gonna try and smoke Mr. Donahue over there on his big rig. Pretty much, you can strap anything to this bike and go for long rides, or you can go racing, like what we're gonna do today. We're pretty much a base camp at FOD, Neil. You know what that means, first challenge to the top. Yeah, and us beautiful people here in the UK aren't really blessed with much altitude. You're not that small. Yeah, anyway, Neil, it's, we're, it's like 50 meters, but they're all punchy. Yeah, so, come on then. E, uh, enduro bike, I would say e-bike. <laughs> Unfortunately not, enduro bike versus trail bike. Neil, I'm gonna click this to lock and I'll see oh, you. I gotta lock out as I'll well. I'll see you at the top, Neil. I can't reach it, but I've got to lock out. <laughs> Oh, he's off. <laughs> Did I flick that up, Neil? Oh, God. Sorry. Oh. All right, I'm sat at 160 heart rate. You, Blake? I like 150. So not a lot of difference in our heart rate. So don't tell us everything. We don't have power meters, so we don't know. You were quicker. I reckon that's the Blake power. Uh, yeah. Well, I think it comes down to the angles of the bike. So the head angle on this is a 66 head angle, but yeah. if you like flip it and chip, it goes down to 65.5. But it's got that XC aspect to it, hasn't it? So it's got that climbing thing to it. Yeah. And it's come, it's pretty light for this kind of bike. This yeah. 14 point six six kilos. I mean, trail bikes generally are a bit lighter, but it's it's a bit, it's so hard to quantify. Mm. Interesting thing here, this all bear rail on is, is mega light for enduro bike. It's actually the same weight, it's 40 and a half kilograms. Well, that's the same weight as this. Although I have put enduro casing tires on. So have you got inserts? They get a fit, no, I haven't, but 
Like, wheels are going to weigh more, they're going to roll a bit slower, potentially, so mm -hmm. not quite as efficient, anyway. Yeah, wow. Well, Neil, yeah. to the top more. Come on out. All right, as the saying goes, what goes up must bomb down some rough downhills. You're all about the speed on the hill, aren't you? Shall we start with the roughest downhill here first? No, Neil, I, no, come on, no. Let's hit up GBU Trail, some flow first, and then drop into some rough. Some rough as guts. Yep. Okay, when it comes down to the bike, the bike is, for example, Neil's bike is super capable. It makes you push even harder. Like my bike, I feel like it's very capable. I've just got a puncture, but on the other hand, Neil, I, think it is, I heard I, something up there. This is capable, I'm incapable. You're right. So, particularly my arms are incapable of having a G out <laughs> and doing a big bench press and uh, did not end so well. You know, that was a horrible crash. It was quite bad, look at yeah, the scratch. Oh. Oh. You broke your car in a bit. Oh. Oh, Neil, but... It's looking very second hand. That's the thing, right? When your bike feels like you can go fast, it can go fast wrong quick. It did. Does that make good English? <laughs> it does. Fast gone quick? <laughs> fast gone wrong quick? Gone quick. Let's roll down for a cup of tea. Cup of tea, Neil. I've got to fix the puncture. All right, the flow, the jumps, Blake, what's the story? Oh, Neil, I'm all about the flow and the jumping, as, I, as we know it, but this thing is super playful. JR, I've called it, the Jack Russell of all trail bikes. It's super playful, it's all over the place. Every bike's got to have a name, hasn't it? Yeah, but, JR. Uh, yeah. And I guess it could be like a little slope style bike. Oh yeah, if I went for a small size, oh man, yeah, you could throw this thing around like no man's business. But I think for bigger jumps, like this goes well on the poppy stuff, <laughs> I could see how that could be better. For bigger jumps, more travel, feels a bit more forgiving, I suppose. Definitely, this will get out of its comfort zone very quickly if I went deep. But if we're gonna give a point for jumps and flow, I'll give it to this one. <laughs> All right, downhill trails. God, Neil. This, I slow down a little bit because I kind of get out of my comfort zone, not with all the travel that you've got. I think there's one clear winner. It's not me. It's the trail bike. I mean, it's, no, it's, it's the not. enduro bike. It's the enduro bike, for it's sure. Bottom downhills, they are. Like, yeah, downhill bike is going to be better for some stuff, but not even all downhill tracks are better on downhill bikes. Because no. if they're a bit flatter, yeah. or they're poppy, exactly. enduro bike's the winner. Got to be. Definitely that. Definitely went down the trail really fast. With me on it or with, without you? With it both off and on. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, we now haven't finished yet. We're at the bottom. We have to get to the bottom. Ready? After, after you. <laughs> after me. After me. Yeah, after that. After that, Neil. Right, trail versus enduro bike. Tell us what you achieved down below. Right, we've got five more seconds. You go first, Blake. Tell me what else a trail bike's good for. Oh, dirt jumping, epic rides, bike packing, cross country racing, enduro racing, epic rides. I think I've said that. Uh, you, said that you can do everything on this thing. All right, I'll go next. You can race downhill, enduro, hit big jumps. Kind is that of, it? Kind of run out of things. You have, yeah. Does that mm -hmm. mean that is a jack of all trades, though, a master of none? No, it's jack of all trades, masters of fun. Wow, snappy. New tagline. Yes. Love it. Uh, let us know what you like down below. Is it trail bike? Is it enduro bike? Give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. See you later. Cup of tea? Yeah. Cup of tea. Ma multi tool? You can have that. No, I've got Pink. loads. It's not toe pig.